Hey, Mike and John from PumaPlow.com playing some more Farming Simulator on the Xbox. Here in Hagenstavara. So, this is your third trailer train? Yes. Or fourth or fifth? And I or don't have a great thing. demand anymore. It's okay. And Think it's not quite full. Not at all. Obviously, by your capacity down there. Yes, yeah, so we'll see. We need to pull up our finances, and it's the next day, unfortunately. You made $3 million yesterday. Yeah. Wow. Um, yeah. So, good times. So, you have a lot of money. Yes. That's my deep thought for the day, the, John. The $3 million that I made was off of three trips with this. Oh, that's right. This is the fourth trip. This is the, the fourth. You had like three and a half trips, basically. Yeah. So well, three and 70%. Right. So, yeah. So welcome to our this. 50th farewell video goodbye. thing. Goodbye. That was a good way to call it, right? Sure. 50th farewell goodbye thingy. Thingy majig. <laughs> Don't forget, Monday, special farm sim videos coming at you. That's right. They're so. pretty awesome. Yes. So, here's the thing, John. Yes. For as much work as we put in those videos, Yep. everybody needs to watch them five times. Everybody really, honestly, I just want them to hit the thumbs up button. That'd work. If, if they like the video, that would make me very happy. And watch it five times. Well, that too. But Thanks, you're the best. <laughs> definitely hit the thumbs up button. I would really appreciate it. Yeah. And they're short, so you watching them five times is no big deal. Yeah, just put them on loop. I mean, you could probably watch it ten times. Wow. You're getting a little obsessive now. I know, right? <laughs> Pretty awesome, right? Yeah. So, what vehicle did you buy today? Um, uh, I had to buy a cultivator because I messed up something. Oh. I was hoping you wouldn't notice. <laughs> I you shouldn't be on your money screen then. I was going across the field that I'm going to show you in a minute. Yeah. Like the last field to plow. Yeah. And I accidentally dropped my plow. Oh. <laughs> There's a big plow spot in the middle. Uh, so yeah. I went and bought a cultivator uh -huh. and cultivated it so that the higher worker door would actually plow it again. Right. And then I sold it. And you've plowed all the fields except one, right? Uh, Yeah, we'll get there in a second. So. Okay, fine. I have a couple to plow. We won't yet. talk about it. Whatever. No, we won't. <laughs> Just sit here and watch you sell canola or whatever. I plowed for like ever. Here, we'll show them. Ooh, they're all plowed. So the only ones that aren't plowed are, you know, 14, 15, 16. Right. Everything else is plowed. Okay. Go. I plowed a lot. Yeah, I bet 40 took a while. It was fair. 40 I did with one plow. Yeah. And just let them go. And you went back and cleaned up all the end rows yourself. All the end rows have been, have been plowed. That's crazy. Um, yeah. Two more trailers. So when we get this empty, we'll drive back to the homestead just with the tractor. Okay. We're going to leave the trailer train here. Uh, Sven said he'd pick it up. No big deal. Man, that Sven sure is a nice uh, guy. Yeah, because I'm going to sell everything. still don't so. understand why there's a guy from Scandinavia in Germany, but, you know, whatever. Immigrant, yo. Uh, he came for a better life. Yes. He came for the beer, stayed for the better life. That's right. Mm -hmm. to, the, to the motherland. Right. But I'll have to pull up a little bit so I can unhook. Cause, right. you know, it's still in the dumper. As we learned in last my last video. Yes. Can't unhook while you're in a dump zone. No, you cannot. Also can't dump while you're in an unhook zone. Wait, what? I don't know. Why are they called parkways, but driveways are called? Why do you drive on a parkway and park on a driveway? That's the one. I don't know, right? I bet you're okay. I'm gonna speed time up too. I know where you're going. <laughs> exactly. That's what I'm gonna speed Dark. time up. So as you can see, fields plowed. Ooh, with end rows. End rows. Two two end rows or two passes per field. Yeah. One round. Sure. As they call it, and that's every field except for the last three. Turn left. I will. It's just showing the fields. End rows. Yeah. So what I would do is I would really, like, plow a little area, and then I would stop the one tractor. Right. Because I have four tractors that are plow plowing right. tractors. Uh-huh. And uh, so then I'd just use the fourth one to kind of clean up in that area. Right. And then I'd move them on. All right. So <laughs> I was hoping it would be daytime, but that's okay. It'll be daytime in a second. So, look what I've got here. Three plows, no waiting. Wow, it's like a plowing party. So, we're on 15. We're going to start them up. Okay. And uh, have a plowing party. For a second, anyway. Yeah, until they get to the other end of the field. Dude, they roll. And collide. Dude, it's the power of the urses. Right. I'm telling you. Actually, if I do, just do... Yeah, I had them all in line and everything. So, if I hit left Ooh. on my D-pad, they would go. I'm good, I know. So, yeah. Good times. Plow. All right, jump to the first one. You send him over to 14 now? Yeah, we'll send him right over. 
Isn't that awesome? That's pretty cool. <laughs> so, yeah. These little tractors have turned a few hours with these plows. Dude, seriously. Where's your fourth one at? Uh, sitting somewhere? in the yard. Just, just don't need them right now? No. Since I can only hire three. Right. That would be something they should fix. Four hired workers. Five. I was thinking like six. Yeah. I mean, it depends on what you're doing, but, man, there's times where you could really use, like, six hired workers. Yes. And better headlights. And headlights that actually shine somewhere. Yes. Yeah. Um... <laughs> Turn your plow the other way, sir. So you're gonna put two on 14 because it's a bigger field. Yeah, we'll just let the one go on uh, 15, 16. Sure. So, so realistically, yeah. that field shouldn't take that long. No. Whoop. Still don't know how to drive the plow though. Clearly. So. Uh, hey, it's daytime. Look at that. All right, we're gonna stop right here. It's a fast time before it rains. Uh huh. So I've got one last load of silage to sell. Wow, that's a lot of silage you've cleaned out of there. I know, right? I was actually taking it off both ends, as you can tell. I wonder you have so much money. Um, yeah. So this lizard loader has a few hours on it, too. Uh, yeah. But I've never had to fill it up with fuel, I don't think. It's very fuel efficient for a loader. Yeah. Yeah. So I turned a few. This is what I was doing while I was plowing. Right. I was doing silage, and I wasn't fast timing. Sure. I guess because of the threat of rain, or no, the selling of the crops, that's what it was. Right. Um, so, yeah. And same thing. Sven said he'd uh, pick this up for me. Man, Sven's a nice so guy. So we're just going to like leave it somewhere random. Like Seriously. Hang on. Can we reach that? Can you put it on top of the wall? I was just going to see if I could grab it on top. Oh. Uh, nope. Turn, turn, turn. There you go. Wow. You know, for as nice as Sven is to you, you're kind of mean to him. All the oil's gonna leak out of the engine. All right, good luck, Sven. <laughs> <laughs> now jump. No, That's go back. Funny. No, oh. actually jump out. <laughs> oh, there you go. Okay, now you can go whatever. All right, so we still have this sitting here. Um, I don't know. You should get your fourth plow and plow. Okay. Let's do, do some it. do some manual plowing. Manual plowing. Since it's hard. It's not that bad. It pulls a little. It though. pulls. Yeah, power of the earth is though. All tractors pull, but okay. It sucks that you have to go speed one. Right. Oh, is he not going? Okay, he's going. he is. He's just I turned around. I didn't think he was going. Give, give your guys a little bit I of credit. I was about to open a can of whoop ass on him. Really? Yeah. Okay. It's beef flavored. Is it? Yeah. I thought it was chicken. No, beef. Huh. Here in Hagenstead, it's beef. Oh, in America, Maybe, it's over there chicken. In America. That's what it is. Yeah. Yeah, I, I forgot. So, yeah, good times. Look at the field you plowed together. They look so nice. Dude, I'm professional. I know. And I didn't even go back with the planer. Right. I, I should have on the other side just a little bit. There's a little bit sticking out on the other side. It's not bad, though. Right. But, yeah. Isn't my $14 million pretty? It really is, yes. I'm going to buy, like, windmills. You could buy, like, almost seven of them. Probably not. Nah. Maybe a couple solar panels. I'm a hippie. Pivot! After all. I just like saying pivot. Dude, I've got this down. I'm good. Clearly. After all my end rows. Are you used to going this way, though? No. Usually you're doing end rows, you know. Yeah. Put that first wheel in the furrow, you know. Did you have to fill up with diesel? Because you sure have a lot in this tractor. Well, no, I know I didn't use the same tractor for all the end rows. Oh, you switched I would, through. I get you now. I would switch around. Right. So let's say, like, on 17, 18, 19, and then 21, 22, or whatever. Uh-huh. I would plow all those fields and then go do the end rows with that tractor. Oh, I get you. And let the other tractors be hired right. somewhere else. So all the tractors are low, low on fuel. I've, yeah, I've plowed a fair amount with all of them. Except for the guy that did 40 because, you know. He was busy. He did 40 ever. for hours. Right. Weeks. So. Oh, you're missing a spot. And that's okay. Sven will take care of it, too. What doesn't Sven do? Dude, he's a genius. Jeez. I didn't miss any. Yes, you did. I totally did not. Yes, you did. Right there. I did. See it? Hold on. <laughs> oh, hey, Plow. How I are you? I didn't miss any. Turn your beacons on, guys. Come on. You're going to have sideways plowing. No, I won't. There you go. Okay. Okay, you're good now. It was about to there. <laughs> totally not how you'd plow a real field. Didn't miss that at all. You're but right, John. whatever. I don't know what you're talking about. Uh-huh. I should get the Magnum and plow with it. It would plow it. It's just sitting there after there. Why do you have a Magnum? It's my hauling tractor. 
Oh, sorry, I was thinking Steiger. No, no, quad track. No, I sold that thing. That's what I thought. I was really confused. That was my dirt working tractor until I realized that you can use the Ursus. For everything. Yeah. If only the Ursus were popular in America, I would have been able to use them. I know, right? But you just couldn't find them at the store. Uh, give it a couple weeks. I think so. they might they might be getting a shipment. In. Oh, really? Yeah. They're, they're finally going to import them? Yeah, in about uh, three to four weeks, I think. Really? Yeah, I think the... Okay. Um, so what the uh, Ursus Weekly told, said, you know, the magazine. That Dude, it's a website. Come on. No, it's a magazine. We're in Germany. Stuff's uh, a little behind. You don't have the internet in Germany? No, what's huh. the internet? Is that on computers now? Yes. That's how people watch us on YouTube.com slash Pumaplow. Oh, I forgot about that. Come on, John. Anyway. <laughs> so, yeah. We're going to let him finish and then start. Yeah, I was kind of thinking he might want to. Yeah. So, yeah, and stuff. Kind of just need to. Actually, let's just go and spam. Help it. out the other field? No, because that, it'd be in the middle, and that's just weird. Okay. No? So, what are you doing? I'm going to plow this pass. What, what about your guy? That's all right. We'll collide. Okay. <laughs> sure. Episode 50 with 100% more collisions. That's right. That's what you did on yours, right? Tried. Yeah, it didn't work. No, nah, I got there in time. Yeah. Never enough plowing. Sure. Yeah. You guys are rolling, though, man. I'll tell you what. Yeah, I know. They move around along at 10 miles an hour when yeah. you got, you know, three or four of them going. Sure. I cover. noticed that plowing in America, too, with just one guy. You can cover some ground with one of these big plows. I mean, you know. It's just a slick move. Sure. Yeah. It's totally not how you would actually plow. Nope. But that's okay. Oh, don't want to. So you're going to eat his plow. It's all good. Situation clear, area normal. Wow. It's not the droids you're looking for? Not at all. Drop. So now what I can do is actually go put this guy on the other field. Okay. Get three plows on one field and then use the other guy to do the interrupts. Sure. So. Let's do it. Yeah. I'll do it. Let's get her done. I need a fourth plow or a fifth plow. Why? I don't know. So you can not drive two at the same time? Yeah. Okay. For multiplayer, yo. Yeah, because there's multiplayer. So let's game. just put him, like, right here. Sure, why not? Sure. Go. How convenient that was. Seriously. It's like I planned it or something. Something. Let's yeah. see these beautiful plowed endros. we get there. Turn around. Which you would never do in real life, but whatever. Uh, you kind of do. Yeah. That's what okay. the cultivator's for. Well, it's true, too. Cleans it up. I totally missed that. Dude, okay. that's pathetic. Wow. But that's already plowed because that's where I plowed it. Right. So it's, it's Sure, good. we'll use that as an excuse. Yes, we will. Uh-huh. Well, but it's hard to plow all these damn trees. Yeah. Maybe that's going to back up and hit skills. They're truly multiplying. There's a tree back there I'm going to hit. Yep. But I didn't because I'm a professional plower. Mm-hmm. Uh, but I missed that. Oops. I guess I just lost professional status, huh? <laughs> Yeah, you're back to amateur. Sorry. Damn. Oh, your tractor's turning left in the middle there. It's all right. You needed to turn right. That's okay. Anyway. That was awesome, though. Three plows going. Uh-huh. <laughs> it reminds me of when you play with, like, classic stuff, and you have, like, three or four things in one field. Right, because they are one slow. Them. Yeah. Good old classics. Yeah, you don't know anything about that, right? Nope. Okay. Don't know anything about the classic pack. The craptic pack? Uh-huh. Actually, you know what? It's, it's not, not as bad as I thought no. originally. That's because your beloved uh, Schluter, little Schluter's in there. Schluter. So, yeah. Schluter. We're just going to do some rock climbing. Schluter. That's pretty normal when you plow, right? Are you a billy goat? Yes. Yeah, everybody rock climbs when they plow, John. There, I nailed that one perfect. Yeah. You have to make a third pass. Eh, maybe not. No. It, it sticks over more than you think. Apparently. So, oh, and so far I'm driving like a drunk man. Well, there now. you go. End rows. And plowed. Okay. So we're just going to leave him here. Uh-huh. Be lined up, ready to go. And uh, handle this guy. Yeah, he's in the way. He's not in the way. He's just misunderstood. Oh, is that what it is? He's in, the bad, he's in a bad spot. How's that sound? He was on the wrong side of the tracks. Right? Yeah. You don't want to get burned. That'll work. So you're making 14 disappear pretty quickly. 
Yes. You think plows are where it's at, man. I know, right? So much better than... Uh, even the even the what plow right before it? Hold on. The, uh, the, the Lemkin? Yeah. Yeah. And it's only like a meter wider. You know, it's really yeah. 1.05 meters wider, yep. which is nothing. But it's awesome. But it works so much better. And you can use a smaller tractor because you're not putting weight on your tractor. Right. right. I mean, you're putting a little bit, but... I'm pretty sure you can plow... He's like, going to have to go back, isn't he, over there? Yep. But like, I could plow with my little schluters if I wanted to. I use big schluters for it. Yeah. But I bet you could plow with the little ones. Most likely. So. This is the guy I wanted. Why? Make sure he's going to go back. He's going to have to go back. There's a strip there. Yeah. I don't know if he will, but... Oh, it's getting wider. Yeah. Yeah, I'll probably have to uh, make him, though. No, I think he'll go. We shall see. Want to bet me on it? No. Nah. Not at all. Look at that beautiful sunrise here in Hagenstad. Um, over the plow. Yeah, it's getting bigger now, so he'll yeah. definitely go back. He'll have to go back. Yep, he's just like Kate. That's right. Or Jack, actually. Yeah. Jack had to go back. Kate didn't really care. No. Just saying. I mean, I don't know. I've never watched so. It's a great show. You should watch it. Why do I keep going the wrong way? I'll give you the first four seasons on DVD if you I'm want good. to. You'll have to watch the last two on Netflix. <laughs> or, you know, just watch all six. Although, a lot of bonus material, which is pretty cool. I'm good. So. I'm good. Turn the plow. Anyway, where are you going? He's done. Oh, he's done. Done. Yep. On to the next one. Now I gotta fold it up. Yep. Yeah, because it's a real pain in the butt driving with those out. Yeah. He didn't go. Um, there's two missed stripes, isn't there? Uh. There's one right here. Yeah, the other one's not as noticeable, but there are definitely two stripes there. Huh. What a bomb. What in the world it's are you doing? Good for the plow. Huh? That's where I want him to go, right there. Right. I think you're going to have to drive it, though. Maybe, and then, and then on the do way the next back, one on your way back, yeah. Well, he's doing it. Oh, is he doing that now? Yeah, he's he's driving, not me. Oh. Uh, this guy. So I, think, I don't think he's going to do that next drive, though. No, I'll, I'll take care of it. But he'll mess up your end rows. It's okay. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Oh. Yep. Just as long as they look decent, I don't really care. I like symmetry and stuff. See, I don't really care. As you'll, if you drive around this map, you'll see that I don't really care. <laughs> but for the most part, they're pretty good. Yeah. Um, there's a couple of them that, you know. Dude, you just made that corner like a perfect 45. <laughs> All right. That's awesome. Train professional at right. work. Look at it, though. Yeah. That's awesome. What can I say? Train professional. Yeah, you screwed up. <laughs> Should have kept the 45 going. You just messed it. That would Although, be impossible with, with the this way plow the, set up. It'd be impossible. The way my plow is turned, I'd have to turn it back the other way, right. which would be improper. But it would be cool. Improper plowing. Oh, no. Dot com? To duck two points or something. Sure. Right. Beautiful. Beautiful endros. Turn him. We'll be done with this guy. Apparently, we're just going to park him all over here in the grass. Apparently. Sven, uh... Gonna come pick these up too. Yeah. Man, he's a nice guy. Yeah. Um. Why okay. did he stop? Because his. Oh, little, he's actually out. Yes. His little nub stopped. Yeah. All right. Okay, turn around. Let's turn your plow for funsies. And drive this one. Go. See if he'll do that. Apparently, yeah. Okay, now we'll do Endros down here and be done with Yay. plowing. All 42 hours that it took me to do this. Mm -hmm. Pretty much. It was actually, it really didn't take as long as I thought it was going to. Okay. I thought it was going to take me to like, you know, Thursday to Thursday to do it all. Right. Um, I did a little bit Sunday night, and then I finished it on, well, I did some on Monday and then finished it on Tuesday. Not bad. So it really was not bad at all. Sure. Uh, it took less time than it did to harvest. Because I didn't have to empty my trailer. You didn't have to babysit them as much. Yeah, no, these, well, because they're kind of small compared to the fields. But, I mean, even, like, you know, planting, you don't really have to babysit them as much either. No. The combine, you're always constantly emptying them. The only part with the planter kind of sucks is they're so big, so they get done so fast. Right. Um, they're smaller planters, John. No, I'm good. 
<laughs> Plant everything with six meter toe behind. Yeah, that'd be great. And miss like everything. Ah, the little two them. meter uh, three point hitch one. Yeah. Get her done, yo. You could on on in Hagen's set here because the could, fields just are not that big. You could do it if you had two or three of those rocking. Yeah. The problem would be fertilizing it. Do it all manually. Yeah, no thanks. Which sucks. Oh wait, that way. That's okay. all. Some parking down here at the end. You're done with plowing. Yay, done plowing. Yay. So we'll, we'll uh, park them all here and then uh, move on to the next thing. Yeah. There's more to this episode. Of course there is. It's only 20 minutes. We can't be done yet. Oh, that's not nearly enough. Oh, he stopped. He didn't mess up your pattern. Yay. How about that? Which makes sense. Professional. Sure. Except you left a spot right there. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Don't, don't, don't raise attention to it. You missed a furrow. All right. So we'll be back with the next part in a second. All right, so we're back with some of the equipment that I've had on this here farm. It's like a walk down memory lane. It, it kind of is. So, we, you know, have the Kramer and the Little Tipper and um, the Fars over here. So it's just funny. You go from the Far to the big case. Seriously. Sitting side by side. Yeah. Um, got my farm all. Yay. Yeah, buddy. Carnhead. Mm -hmm. Sugar Beet Harvester. Mm -hmm. It's awesome. So massive. They really are. I forgot to put his uh, conveyor belt down. Potato harvester. Potato topper. Right, with the booher. The booher. It's a good little tractor. A little expensive maintenance-wise. But it's a great tractor. But a solid tractor, especially when you start out. Yeah. You got the, uh, you know, the crone, uh, what is this one? It's the big M. Big X. Big X. That's xylophone. Xavier here. Z no, that, my Xavier is my farm. Oh. Your Z xylophone. xylophone here. Uh -huh. so this is the tow behind potato harvester. Uh-huh. If you remember, I did have it. No, thank you. And of course, on an Urses. Of course. What else would it be on, John? It's all about the Urses. There's my second combine I ever had. Uh huh. Beautiful. Or something. It's a good combine. A little slow, a little small, but you know. Got the uh, quad track, you know, 600. It's a good tractor. Solid tractor. Right. And there's, you know, the Deutz with the big uh, wagon from our tipper trailer train thing we had. Right. You know, just the valves, you know. Sure. Is. And the Magnum. And, yeah, that's the first batch of the stuff. We couldn't buy it all at once because uh, we have uh, one slot. <laughs> so we'll be right back with the rest of it. And this is equipment part two. Yay. Yay. So things like cultivators. Bad cultivators. Very, very <laughs> bad cultivators. Cultivators that suck. Yeah. Yep. It's a one-star cultivator. Lawnmowers that are tiny, mm. but it has a beacon, so it's it's. And tiny. you know, technically, it's real life for like a little zero turn. I just like how it turns. So. Like, wee. I mean, realistically, that is basically real life for those things. Yeah, it's not bad. It's just small when you consider compared to other equipment. It's like small and that. slow. So yeah, we still have the Magnum here. Yep. With the plow still. Yep. No, this is new. Oh, that's new plow. Yeah. Okay. We we we've kept some of the tractors, so we got this awful semi. It's fast. I just yeah. I don't know. Okay, that's, that's all that. it has going for it. Fertilizer cedar I didn't unfold because I forgot. Yeah, you know. First cedar. Good cedar. Little plow. Uh huh. The wheels for the semi trailer. They go round and round. Yes, they do. The big old cultivator. Of course, behind the you know versus Duh. My most powerful tractor. Header cart, more fertilizer spreader. I don't know which one this is. There's a big that's, and a small. Oh, uh, yeah. I think that's the small one. I don't know. This awful bale trailer. Hey, you said it yourself earlier. The, the trailer's good. It's the bales. But it's the way stuff doesn't lock down is the problem. Yeah. We got the corn slash sugar beet planter. Right. Good piece of machinery. It's pretty awesome. Got the auger wagon. I know you don't like it, but I'm a fan. I like it. It's just another step. Whoa! Oh, don't don't mind that. We got the condor, the mighty mighty powerful condor. Right. Best planter on the game. Oh, by far. The potato planter. Uh huh. The big one. Yeah, the big one. Not the little three point. I'll probably use that next year, next season. The three point. Just because it doesn't miss. Right. I I guess I don't know. I have to try it out, but I'm pretty sure you're right. So I've got the uh, sp tow behind sprayer, fertilizer sprayer. Right. And also have the uh, extra storage tank. As you can see, it's empty. It is. The little right. thing will go up yeah. and it's full. Right. Pretty neat. Um, front weight. Yay. Loading wagon. I'm not sure if this is the loading wagon that I actually had. I can't remember. 
I know I had a loading wagon once upon a time. For your sheep, right? For yeah. grass? Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, I missed the little front mower that I had then. Hold oh, on. Oh, yeah. Um. I had this guy. Yeah, that guy. Yeah. So we'll get to that in a second. Oh, we're back at this stuff now. So, yeah. Little plow and stuff. There's, There's the front mower right there. Yeah, the little front three-point. Yeah, you, you put it on the front of your tractor and then have the pickup wagon behind you and do it all in one step. Yeah. Sure. I mean, or you could use the this this uh, mower on the back. You could, sure. If you had, like, a little tractor, you could. Right, and then pick it up afterwards. Yeah, or if you're doing missions, <clears throat> it's actually pretty good for missions. Yeah, on like a You're right. Like a, uh, ur not an Ursus. Something small. A Booher. Yeah, a Booher. Or even smaller than that. Like a Kramer could probably handle it. Um, let's see. Let's buy a Kramer. <laughs> hmm. Sitting right there. It might be a little big for the Kramer. Yeah, it might be. Uh, the Kramer is only a 17 horsepower tractor or whatever. Yeah. So. Okay, it's going to be a little big, but whatever. But yeah, the, the Bruher, uh, that red one, the whatever it is. Yeah, it's a good little tractor. Um, it would probably work on there pretty you good. drive? And I drive without doing wheelies. That's what I'm saying. I don't like no, it. No, kind of. Drive, I can't turn. Yeah. You go so yeah, it's a, it's a little big for this. Yeah. The, here's something that would be good for it. The classic fertilizer that you put on the front of your tractor when you're doing six meter stuff. Yep. That actually looks pretty good on there. It looks big. Look, can you lower it? Uh, yeah. See, now it looks okay if you lower yeah, it. Yeah, it looks a lot better now. Yeah. So that's all of my equipment. There you go. That I've pretty well had for, you know, traded in and out as I've uh, done these 50 episodes. Right. So next you'll see something very special. And we're going to say bye now. Yep. So say bye. Until next time, it's Mike and John from PumaPly.com. See you. Toodles.